Welcome to the IBM Software as a Service demonstration series. In this series, we will demonstrate a set of architectural patterns exploiting features in IBM middleware to build software as a service solutions. The Software as a Service demo series includes seven demonstrations based on a fictitious banking application. Each demonstration shows a scenario in the banking application which addresses some technical challenges relevant for building a software as a service solution. This demo is part of the scenario describing how to enforce security in a software as a service application. In particular, this demo will show how to secure human tasks and workflows using WebSphere Process Server and Tivoli Directory Server. The scenario, Enforcing Security in a Software as a Service Application, demonstrates an approach for addressing three technical challenges. One, how can you prevent the user population of one tenant from accessing the virtual portal of another tenant? Two, how can you enforce role-based access control for different tenants for the user interface layer? And three, how can you enforce role-based access control for human tasks and workflows? In this demo, we will look at the third technical challenge, namely how can you enforce role-based access control for securing human task assignments in a workflow. In this demo, we will show the use of the LDAP staff resolution plugin feature in WebSphere Process Server to secure human tasks and BPEL processes with a common user registry. The process of deciding who should work on a human task is called staff resolution. The LDAP staff resolution plugin provides access to organizational information that is stored in LDAP directories so that a human is assigned to the appropriate owner in the multi-tenant LDAP user registry. In the banking application, we will demonstrate how the human tasks for approving a loan application in a BPEL process is assigned only to users in the roles bank employee and bank manager. First, we show how to configure the staff resolution plugin. We open the WebSphere Process Server Administration Console and navigate to the Staff Plugin Provider Configuration Panel. By default, there are three kinds of Staff Plugin Providers, LDAP, System, and User Registry. In our case, we use the LDAP Staff Plugin Provider. For each plugin provider, there can be many different configurations. We use the LDAP Staff Plugin Configuration Sample. For this configuration, we set the base distinguished name as DC equal Bank 1, comma DC equal COM, so that all Bank 1 users can be found in our LDAP directory. We also set the LDAP server address to the URL as shown here. In this demo, only Bank 1's users are eligible for human task assignments. In order to extend this capability to users in a multi-tenant environment, you need to exploit the dynamic staff assignment features in the WebSphere Process Server's Human Task Manager. This can be done programmatically through Java code snippets inside the process as shown here. In addition, the dynamic staff selection features in the Human Task Manager replacement expressions can be utilized as shown here. Now we will execute a BPEL process for loan application approval with Human Tasks to demonstrate the staff resolution functions. We log in to the Bank1 portal as Bank1's user B1U2. In the Mortgage Products portlet, we apply for a loan product. We use $100,000 as the loan amount and submit the request. From the Check Loan Status portlet, we see this request has been sent for review. Since we requested a large loan amount, this loan will need both a bank employee approval and a bank manager approval. Next, we log in to the Business Process Choreographer Explorer as a Bank1 employee, B1E1. We see that there is one human task item listed here. Next, we click the human task item and see the input message and staff relevant information. For this human task item, the user B1E1 has been set as the potential owner. This demonstrates how the LDAP staff resolution plugin acts in concert with the BPEL container in WebSphere Process Server to find the human tasks assigned to the role bank employee. Next, we claim this human task item and approve it. 
After submitting, we can see that there are no other human task items listed for B1E1. Next, we log in to the Business Process Choreographer Explorer as a Bank One Manager, B1M1. Now we see the Manager Approval item listed here. We click this human task item and see that the user B1M1 has been set as the potential owner for this human task. We claim this item and approve it. This loan has now been approved by the bank employee and the bank manager. Now the Bank One user B1U2 logs into the Bank One portal to check the loan application status. Here we can see that the loan has been approved. In conclusion, we have demonstrated how to use the LDAP Staff Resolution plugin in WebSphere Process Server to build secure BPEL processes with human tasks. IBM has innovative resources and programs to help you manage change and become relevant in the software as a service market. Whether you're an ISV, system integrator, or reseller, we can provide education, support, and benefits to help you grow revenue and differentiate yourself. The first step will be to join the SAS community. You will automatically be kept aware of new SAS technical benefits and workshops and get the enablement help that you need to transform your application for delivery in the IBM Software as a Service model. Then, as a member of the IBM SAS community, you can register at the Virtual Innovation Center, VIC, where you will get personalized access to product support and education to help build your software as a service knowledge and skills. As an advanced level member of Partner World, you have the opportunity to gain access to additional marketing and sales support by qualifying for the software as a service specialty. For more information, visit our main site at www.ibm.com slash partnerworld slash sas.